Hi guys, this is Adi from Nolkar Outdoor. Today my project is I wanna replace the impeller, my water pump here. Uh, on a, this is Mercury outboard 120 uh, HP. So the issue that I have is uh, on the low RPM, it doesn't be well. So it's only uh, take the water a little bit. So the water is really doesn't flow really good. When a high RPM, yes, it looks good, but the low RPM is not. So uh, I the last time I changed it a few years ago, so I need to uh, check it. So I'm sure it's not really good anymore now. So I already uh, got all the part here. All right, this is what you need. You need this uh, RTV silicone. This is you put it around the housings. So you need the grease for sure. And this is the the set, the uh, impeller set that I bought. So it come with, uh, let's see here, let me open it. So the impeller itself. And this is the gasket and also the o-ring here. Come with the plate too. I will check if this, uh, the existing one is better or not. I mean, it's probably, I, I'm not sure I'm going to change it or not. Uh, probably I will, since this one come with the set, including the outdoors. So this and you need this wrench and also this uh, for this because uh, this is uh, they don't have an, enough space so you're going to use this wrench but for uh, the bottom one here on the front you can see on the front here so you will need this wrench all right <clears throat> I'm about ready to take it off, uh, take the lower unit off. So my engine is uh, 2016, so I think 2015 and 16, they don't have a clips in here. So I think be 2014 probably or uh, below uh, before that, they have a clip that you have to take it off. For mine is not, so I don't need to take the clip off here. So make sure you check your engine if there's uh, any clips in here that you need to take it off. And also, uh, I want to drain this uh, oil here. It's on the gearbox. So when I take it off, I don't mess up with the oil. I will take the oil off, then I will replace it uh, at the same time after I'm done with the impeller. The oil is looks uh, okay. There's I don't see any like uh, water uh, mixed with water or something. So I think the seal is still good. So it stopped dripping. So all gear oil already out. So I will put the screw here back. Then I can start to take the lower unit off. for the bolt this is have a uh, two right in here so on the other side have two two and then uh, it have one in here on the front For this four bolt, I will lift this little bit here, so don't take everything all the way. So when we drop it, it won't fall down, so we can take it later. Just take it off slowly. All right, there you go. So this is the pump, I uh, just wipe it a little bit, 
so I need to remove this housing this housing has a one two three four bolts so I need to take this off and check it and this one has a rubber uh, o-ring here you can take this off Alright, now uh, let's take this uh, four bolt off. Slide this up. Don't lose the pin. This pin. This is to lock it here. If you see here, this uh, you can uh, put it here so it will lock. And also look at this. Uh, this looks not too bad, but doesn't uh, pee, uh, pee well on mine. Probably this one is uh, is not really elastic anymore or something. So I don't see any crack. Let's see this pattern here. Uh, from the top, if you see from the top here, it will uh, turn clockwise. So it will turn to this way. So you will see this. This is uh, when you put it back, it will turn like this. So when you put it back, you squeeze it and put it uh, counterclockwise because we put it on the other side, right? And when they turn, it will turn clockwise that all right I will take this off here so the housing is looks uh, good actually it's not looks too bad I will clean this up a little bit this one is not I didn't see anything bad actually not too bad but I will uh, replace it anyway so put it something that's a uh, uh, new and elastic so it will touch the uh, the housings better as you see this plate this plate has the rubber here rubber seal and mine doesn't come with it so i don't see any the rubber seal around this plate so i will reuse this uh, that rubber just replace the plate but uh, reuse the rubber so it looks like this one is uh, kind of hard so I'm going to use a screwdriver to take it off there you go kind of sticky slide it I need to clean this up So already clean it up so it looks good here after i clean it up just i don't see any issue i think i can reuse this really well there's no problem with this housing and again for this uh, i already compare it with the between the new and the old i think I, I bought the wrong one maybe i'm not sure but uh the part number is the same but the, the bad one about the uh this new one is usually they have like uh, they have the, this one is not really flat this one is kind of little bit up so if this one is up it will prevent this from uh, turning uh, scratching all the uh, the base here 
but this one is flat both both sides are flat so yeah i think this is the original one so the original one i can see this one lift, lift it up a little bit in one side and one side is flat so i will use this again so i will use it things should be still okay all right so this one i'll be cleaning it up uh i need to put the uh, silicone tube in here uh, i will just put it in silicone later i think that this uh, rubber is still good so i don't need to put the silicone but i will put the grease so remember this pin so i'm going to put it here but i will put grease so it will sticky And to put this one first, put this back. Good. Oh, I think I used the. So I want to put grease a little bit in here, not too much. Alright, before I forget, I'm going to put the grease also on the housing. Yes, a little bit thin layer only this should be enough. Right and put this here. Stick it here. So the grease help this stick oh there so, okay this is the new one like i mentioned before this one is uh, clockwise so it will turn this way so uh, from in from the back here i will turn it counterclockwise so this So this is uh, facing this way and this this I need to turn it up uh, to here so I'll turn this with so this box may give grease just a little bit here I can slide better okay Go. Yes. Put this bolt back. Okay. 
있죠. So time to put it back again there. So I'm just thinking to put this little bit uh, on silicone still. I'm going to put uh, grease here. Connect it to free will. Okay, now it's time to put it back. Sometimes it's hard, so I need to move the free wheel a little bit. There you go. So if this is slightly hard, so you need to uh, turn the three wheel until they match. So I think we do have a lot of all the points, I can have the loss. 
so that's it guys uh, so it's the power is done now so I'm going to uh, change uh, refill the uh, gear oil and then I try it uh, thanks again for watching and please subscribe and help me with us uh, subscribe and click the bell please alright guys thank you bye